So your dad tells me you're um, you're thinking about relocating. Well, to be honest with you, I'm not really sure what I want to do. You know, I could always keep working as a dental assistant. You know, that person that sucks the spit out of your mouth with that little wet back yes. and then gives you a free toothbrush and a lollipop. <laughs> you do know what the lollipop's for, right? Well, I'm Repeat assuming business. <laughs> you know, if it were up to me, I'd just give them caramel apple or a little taffy or something. Pull their teeth right out of their little heads. Now that's how you make money off children. Well, that and baby beauty pageants. <laughs> Right. Do you have a girlfriend? Uh, no, I do not. I just went through a breakup. Oh, you poor baby. I'm so sorry. Could you put some suntan lotion on my back? Uh... Well, don't forget to rub a dub dub. Rub a dub dub. Yeah, hey, you gotta rub it in. Oh. oh okay. Would you be a minute if I pop the girls out? What? You know, get a little color on Kim and Chloe. Oh, yeah, go ahead. Oh. Where are you going? Uh, I just need to do this thing that I need to do. <laughs> Hey, I just got off the phone with your dad. He was just calling. Oh, see Lord, you. that man can talk. I swear he doesn't even pause to take a breath. Do you have a sec? Sure. Uh. Okay, yeah, have, have a seat. Uh, wow, this is a nice bed. I bet you could do some serious drilling on a workbench like this, huh? Yeah. yeah so you want to talk to me about something? Do you remember the last time that we saw each other? Dinner? No, silly. I'm talking about when I was like eight years old and you came to visit us and we all went to the state fair. Okay, I remember that. Remember, you had to take me and my mom because my dad was working late and we ate cotton candy for dinner and then you won me that little stuffed pig in the squirt gun horse race. I used to practice my kissing on him. Lucky pig. <laughs> Eventually, I wore out all the terry cloth on his snout, but it was actually okay because by that time I changed over to real boys, which turns out a couple of them were pigs too. Yeah, pigs. But do you want a robe or a blanket or a suit of armor? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm fine. And remember, I wanted to go on the Tilt-A-Whirl, but my mom was too scared, so you said you'd sit next to her, but I wanted you to sit next to me, so you sat in between us and you held both of our hands, but actually, you were the one that got scared and started praying real loud, Oh, Lord, please get me off this ride. I think you even tinkled a little bit. Oh, that's a good memory. I remember because it was one of the best days ever. Aww. Are you lonely? <laughs> you know, I, I, I got Alan. <laughs> yeah, but Alan doesn't keep you warm at night. <laughs> You'd be surprised. <laughs> Listen, um, I have this idea. You know, you m might think that it's kind of crazy. Okay. I was just thinking, you know, since you're single and, I mean, you're super hot and a really nice guy. Yeah? That, you know, maybe you'd like to hook up with my mom. What? She's been all alone ever since my daddy ran off with that lady from the dry cleaners. You know, the one with that weird eye that won't quite open all the way? Probably from all them dry cleaning fumes. You know, we should have seen it coming. She gave him all the clothes that nobody claimed. He had, like, four tuxedos. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> you want to set me up with your mom? She kind of always had a thing for you, but she would kill me if I told you. Okay, Missy, I, I don't think that's Just a good Just think idea. about it, okay? Okay. Great. Oh, and if it helps at all, she actually just got her boobs done. They actually use mine as a model. The doctor even put them in his catalog, number 244. Anyone can get them, but it's kind of weird. Now when I walk around town, I just keep thinking I see my boobs everywhere. <laughs> good night. Her mom? 